What actor can you not stand? Steven Seagal. But actor is kind of a stretch. John Wilkes Booth. Ezra Miller. How soon people forget Andy Dick. Lee Michelle, turns out she's pretty much just as annoying IRL. Stephen Fattis Faker Seagal. Anyone associated with Scientology. Jared Leto. Never liked him. Not looking forward to him in Haunted Mansion. James Corden. Ellen DeGeneres. Cara Delevingne. She cannot fucking act. It's so bad it takes me out of a movie. Gwyneth Paltrow. The answer to this question is always Jared Leto. James Franco. The man is not a good actor. Ezra Miller, you. Gwyneth Paltrow. Snake oil shite Schiller. Danny DeVito, I really can't stand him, because every time I see his face, I fall for him. Marky I'm way tougher than anyone on those planes in 9-11 Wahlberg. Lena Dunham. She's an A.H. Jennifer Lopez. Massive ego with mediocre talent, seems like a huge bitch IRL. Desperately wants people to believe she's humble and relatable while making diva demands and thinking of herself as royalty. Also Madonna. Just seems like an awful person IRL. My fat cat. We put her on a diet and she acts like we starve her. Jada Pinkett Smith. Not much of an actor but James about his two tight polo shirts buttoned to the top. I wanna punch him right in the mush. Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart. Fucking annoying little shit. Andy Dick. Lena Dunham. Adjectives fail me. Jennifer Lopez. Tiffany Haddish. Jared Sentient Enema Pedophile Creep Leto. Jesse Eisenberg for no reason other than his face and voice. Steven Seagal. Miles Teller irrationally angers me it's his face or something f that twat. Can't stand as a person, Tom Cruise. But goddamn if he doesn't make some good movies, though. I want to stop watching him in things, but he keeps being in awesome things. Jennifer Lopez. I can't stand any of the movies she's in. Elizabeth Moss. Through no fault of her own, her face just pisses me off. Woody Allen. Pedro Pascal, because I was a 100 straight until he came along. Damn you daddy. Will Smith and his entire family. Amy Schumer. I have an irrational level of hate for her. Lena Dunham. Vince Vaughn. He doesn't act, he just reads lines as Vince Vaughn. Plus I have a theory that he uses his Hollywood status to live out fantasies he's have had if he wasn't a Hollywood star. Here's how he'd pitch a movie to a producer. So basically it's me and my best mate Owen and we become the coolest guys at any wedding college Google company and we get the girls, and everyone thinks we're cool. Owen says wow a lot. James Franco, a narcissist and a pervert. The Rock. Literally plays himself in everything. Will Smith. That lady from The Handmaid's Tale IDK her name. Gwyneth Paltrow. A Tom Cruise. Both of the Francos. They both have perma goof face and James is a perv. Gwyneth. Miles Teller. Will Smith. Jared Leto. Kevin Hart. He's a small guy that thinks that being loud is funny. Mark Wahlberg. Mark Wahlberg. Apparently, he's religious now, but some of the stuff he did when he was younger was disgusting. 
whenever I see him, it makes me think of his past and I can't enjoy any of his movies. Any Kardashian if you can even call them actors. Ellen. Such a phony. Can't stand her. The Rock. Every damn movie that he makes is the exact same character. The guy has an acting range of a boiled potato. Paltrow, Gwyneth you're fucked, Gwyneth Paltrow. Understanding what you did. James Corden. Steven Seagal. Salman Khan. No one I hope comes even close to being as egotistical and yet untalented as he is. Tiffany Haydish. My god I cannot stand that woman. Amy Schumer. Gwyneth Paltrow, Will Smith, Mark Wahlberg. Christopher Reeve. Tom Cruise. Jared Leto. Every time I see him in a movie, I immediately assume that the character he played did crazy things in real life. Tom Cruise. Fuck that guy and his Scientologist ilk. Millie Bobby Brown. Channing Tatum. That dude has a very punchable face. I don't care how magical his MIC is. And I'm female. Tom Cruise creeps me out. I'm late to the party but, Seth Rogen. I don't even know why. I cannot watch anything with him in it. He makes my skin crawl. Everything from his face, to his voice, to the way he carries himself upsets me. Maybe his ancient evil twin murdered me in a past life or something. The aversion is that strong. Not an actor, despite being in, get him to the Greek Russell brand, he plays himself in Arthur not funny unamused face snore. Seth Rogen. We get it dude, you do weed. 